Well, the, the painting came about over a period of time, but its uh, initiation was uh, my, my association, my, my meeting Mike on walks down the town uh, with two, two dogs who are pets and, and Mike's um, uh, love of the dogs and always meeting them and giving them a treat. And it was a year ago that I, I thought, well, I'd like to paint Mike. Uh, when I heard about his imminent sort of retirement and such, I thought, right, uh, I'll ask. And um, Mike, I think, was a little bit... Um, can, I don't think he understood really the whole process at the start of the, the, the project, but um, I met him at, at the depot before work, uh, very early one morning in the, in the uh, early spring, and I, I did a, a simple line drawing, a sketchbook drawing, which went off quite well. It gave me the impetus, it, it made me feel, OK, I can maybe go on another stage. And I think in that process, Mike understood the, what I was doing in the form of drawing and how serious the whole idea was. And he um, then accepted my invitation to come to my studio here at home and sit for the portraits. And it was, it was right that Mike should be sat, it should be uh, standing in the high street where he's dutifully patrolled for many decades, all these decades. And, and um, I set the, the old town hall, the old municipal town hall as, um, as, the, um, as the backdrop. I thought that was, that, that was right in, he, in his position of the, uh, working for the council. And then there are other details, anecdotes, some of it may be humorous. The, the seagulls, I suppose, anyone who, who lives in Christchurch will always uh, note, you know, they're, they're always above and, and audible, the, the seagulls. I thought that added a bit of animation to the whole picture scape. And uh, we're always shopping too, so there's, there's the, the Saxon Square and, and another detail, which uh, had to be, uh, uh, you know, that hold the, the whole frame of the, pit, the painting together. I think um, I think Mike's been very patient uh, over the sittings. He he he, he was um, he he did sit for the portrait. Although he stood, I obviously made quick sort of sketches and and details about that and the idea of holding his his broom. But um, he did he was comfortable as as much as that he he did sit. But that that was that was interesting. I, I the challenge of the. The, the 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 high visibility yellows within the, the within the the pitch of the whole painting I, I I don't know how successful that overall that's been but that was a bit of a challenge when you've got a such a bright bright fluorescent sort of color to match within the the, the range of the of the color scheme um, but that uh, in a way just purely out of painting and color uh, presented uh, a challenge uh, an interesting challenge. A painting, an artist is aware, is always aware of the, the context, or should be aware of the context of their work uh, and, the, and the approach to the work. Has it, um, has it a, a connection to the historical painting? I mean, it's, it's a bit presumptuous of me, but there, that in the annals of art there are many heroes that have been portrayed on canvas, uh, uh, be it a shield, a sword, uh, a flag, um, I, th I think the connection between uh, someone in a uniform, we've got, we got to acknowledge that Mike is in a uniform, a, a municipal worker, the, hum the, the, the street cleaner, but it has a connection to artworks of other genres, of other motifs that show, dare I say, hero heroes. Well, Mike's our local hero. He's, he, he, may not have, he may not have dueled and, and come back from a campaign from from a uh, with 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 trophy, uh, but his his his, his um, pursuit of uh, of and, and 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 dedication to his job over these these uh, these four decades, nearly four decades, uh, are personified by my approach. He has a he has his uniform. He he holds his his broom, um, but as stoically uh, with the pride of any any general portrayed in uh, in any other art art form or especially in, in this genre of portraiture so yeah I, I think underlying there's that there's that un message in the in the overall construction of the canvas